The lifelong best friend of Dave Courtney has revealed the ex-gangster's last words before his death. 64-year-old Courtney was reportedly an associate of the Cray twins, turned writer. He was found dead at his Camelot Castle home in London over the weekend. His family subsequently revealed that he had taken his own life following a secret battle with prostate cancer. The physical pain of living the lifestyle he chose, especially due to the pain of both cancer and arthritis in his later years, became too much, a statement explained. So rather than be a burden to his family and friends, he chose to stop the ride and take his way out. Friend reveals final words of Dave Courtney before his death. Brendan McGeer, aged 57, who was also Courtney's lodger, was the person to find Courtney dead on Sunday morning, October 22. In an interview with Mail Online, he has since opened up about his best friend's final days and revealed the last words he heard him say. According to Brendan, Courtney spent his final evening watching England in the Rugby World Cup semi-final against South Africa. A joking remark about the team's loss would end up being the last words Brendan heard him speak. Dave watched the rugby with me. We both had a chuckle about England losing in the last minute as usual. I said to him, I'm off to bed, and he said, I'm off to bed too, and that was the last thing he said to me, Brendan said. He then continued, I found his body the next morning and he was at total peace. He made a decision, he controlled his life, he controlled his ending and made the decision. Brendan also explained that he is at peace with his friend's decision. He was in exceptional pain so I totally forgive him, totally understand, and I am so proud of him for how brave he must have been. He went out rock and roll style, he concluded.